Yep, that is a reek eating a Tuscan raider in a field of blood and dirt. How did we get from the peaceful, idyllic times on Endor to this? My name's Xavier, and welcome back to the always extreme Jawas. Here's where we left off last time. This, that, that is too many. I think we've got to run. Disassemble, 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 disassemble. Uninstall, uninstall, uninstall everything. That's our last robe. Let's uninstall this battery. Deconstruct this guy as well. We're going to need to put a caravan parking spot, I reckon, right in here near everything. Okay, everything is disassembled. Form the caravan with literally everyone. So we're gonna pack up all the food, all the meals, all the everything. They done found us, except. All right, boys, pack it up. Whoa! They are definitely shooting high explosive shells at us. And they have not one, but two mortars. Another one's upcoming any second now. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Oh, okay. Luckily, that one missed, but took out our chest table. Woo, that was a close one. Oh, God, here comes two shells. Oh, boy, that one's close. Oh, nice. Right up and over us. Fantastic. And there we go. We are out of here. Woo, just in the nick of time. What the heck is this doofus doing? Forming a caravan move- Oh my god! Kill the Aliolosis! Almost got himself murdered for no reason. Come on, boys, get off the map! The time is now! Oh boy, they're shooting the mountaintop as we're running away! Boom! Fantastic! Yes, they have 11 Luciferium. Yoink, we'll take all of it. We're gonna trade them our most heaviest, most expensive things, Jade and Uranium. Let's buy this phase two, 327th Bark Helmet. Our Rodian melee character is gonna need a Scout Jacket Brown. And while we're thinking about it, let's get an actual melee weapon for them. Vibro Sword it is. We're gonna sell all of our meat because it's all gonna rot anyway. Except, we'll have the scout jacket to go to Renton. Uh, let's also give her the helmet, though. Let's give the thrumbo for robes to all of the Jawas. And Renton can have the vibro sword. Awesome. We do have one battery still. That's good. We lost four, uh, but we still have one. Well, we've lost a huge amount of our mass. We're down to 310 out of 959. And now I'm feeling pretty, pretty good about making an aggressive move against the Tuscan Raider camp. Attack the night sound. Now, my reasons for doing this were first, the Tuscan Raiders and the Jawas have never been good friends in Star Wars lore. So it kind of makes a little bit of sense. Secondly, the droids have been harassing us the whole campaign and forced us out of Endor, and I want to crash them into the ground. But to do that, we're going to need to buy nukes. And nukes are expensive because we modded them to be like 30,000 silver. And the bases in this game with this mod, as time goes on, get bigger and have more rich loot. So there we go. The battle for Tatooine commences. Let's go take a look at the actual Tusken Raider base. Well, they do indeed have a huge base. Holy mother of hash browns, boys. What do we got over here? 100% Tusken Raiders. What are they using for weapons? What are these things? Gadurfi. Okay, and they have a couple of sniper rifles. Oh, it actually looks like they all have those Tusken rifles. How many steel mini turrets do they have? 21. How many uranium slug tarts? Just two. How many auto cannons? Five. Six IEDs. And 11 anti grain warheads. Okay. Though, so, do they have any mortars? I see this one already. <laughs> they have three. However, however, two of them have incendiary shells. This one over here has seven high explosive shells. We're going to have to wait out every single one of those. Oh, this will be amazing. Oh, <gasps> they have a Resurrector mech serum. Too bad R2 got tootled a hundred years ago. 
This time I have a whole new strategy and it involves charging right around the base. This is gonna be amazing. Woo! Nice try. <gasps> we just laid a great dragon egg. BB10, can you load that into the caravan? Load crate dragon onto pack animal. Yes, we can. <laughs> That's so cool. We laid an egg, boss. All right, everyone else, let's keep going. Look at little BB10 with the egg. <laughs> crate dragon egg. Where are all the shells coming? Oh, they're actually coming pretty close. Not a problem. Nice, BB-10 got it loaded up. Let's keep moving them. Whoa! They're attacking our Jawa. What? I was not expecting that. All right. Okay. Uh, my actual plan was to charge around the back, dig a hole through the rock that they'd never actually expect anyone to do, and then come out into the middle of their base that I was all proud of myself. But now they're just like, yeah, nah. Let's kill them. Let's see if we have some surprises we can lay down for them. Oh, uh, they're actually coming up. Oh, yeah, they're coming up here. This is where they're going to come out. And when they do, we've got to be as ready as we can possibly be. Oh, that didn't quite work out the way that I was hoping. Oh, God. Where's the shells? Oh, they're coming right towards us. Keep moving. Oh, nice, they missed. Um, Gomez just installed this. That is very bad. Boom, but you need to get out of there. Oh, Gomez, Gomez, for the love of God. Gomez, oh God. Oh God, Gomez. Go, 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 Gomez, don't stand on the bomb. Oh, there's a thing. Oh, just hit all my auto two's about to get melee. This is not going right. Ooh, that thing missed us at least. Or two, you need to you need to cut your your ways out of here, buddy. Gomez, you need to move before you get stepped on. Run, run! Oh God, run, boys, run, run! Or two, run! Oh, Kyodiolios has died in an explosion. That's what you get for being naked, boys. Kyodiolosuki. My God, what a mess this is. Why are you sleeping, boys? Come on back. Auto 2, come around the corner, please. Oh, nice shooting. I think that was Bumba there. Renton's gonna have to be the one that gets close to do the melee. Almost like already ready for bed here. <laughs> Prepare yourself, boys, for the great Tuscan slaughter of 5502. Oh, what are you doing, Yumi? Oh, what the? Please, Yumi, get out of there. Get out of there. No, don't go in. Oh, I think they're just scared. They don't know. They don't know. Yumi doesn't know, boys. The raiders are already fleeing. What? <laughs> what? Uh, four of them have died. And five of them are running away. Okay. Meanwhile, the shells are still coming at us. Let's see if we can't get all of our animals to come over here now. Outside where I originally wanted them in the first place. Uh, Yumi, for some asinine reason, has decided to flee into the base. Oh my god, that's so bad. Shells are flying everywhere. Yumi, no! Yumi, no! What are you doing now? Come on, Yumi, come on, come on! Yes, Yumi! You're just here making everyone antsy. That's all you're doing. You're just an antsy answer. Let's go. Keep the move on. Okay, the only problem with this is now all of these fires are eventually going to burn our turrets down. So we'll have to have one of our droids go back, like R2. Yeah, they're launching the shells up here at R2 for whatever reason. That's fine. Now, everyone's getting down here. Let's go right on through. So we set out cutting through a huge chunk of stone. While R2 and BB-10 moved our stuff away from the fires so that it didn't get destroyed. And after a full day of mining, after fighting with no food, Bumba was like, wait a minute. Oh no, Bumba's like, I saw what you were doing, Gomez, back in the Endor forest, 
trying to steal my Jawa female. Bongo openly insulted Gomez's intellectual skills. Oh god, this is gonna go on for a while. Uh-oh. Mommy over here is loading this. That's not good. High explosive shell, too. Everyone's sleeping. Imagine if that actually hit right now. Okay, I feel like Gomez is gonna have to go take a break now. He's been working really hard. So Grekoskyok replaced Gomez working in the tunnel. Eventually, Bomba collapsed from exhaustion, all while the raiders just kept on missing. Rishios got an infection, no good. And now he got food poisoning as well. <laughs> this is awesome. Well, at least we have raw meat. That's better than nothing. Gomez went in a daze now. Bomba, it's all you. Get us through. There it is. That's the wall. Right there. Ah, we started attacking their walls, and now they're like, Get them, boys! Well, they're going to come around from the north up there. We're well aware of that. Wow, we broke in the back door. What is this? Steel large statue of colonist? What? It's a masterwork statue, but who is it of? Ulma. It's actually Ulma because she's thin. There's a masterwork statue of Ulma inside their, like, uh, what is this? Weapon storage room that we broke in from behind. This is incredible. Doricrete grand statue of colonists? Title, a turnip. Why are the Tuscan Raiders sitting here making statues of us? This one is actually of Renton because that's the helmet right there and the Twi'lek things are sticking through. So they have a statue of Renton and a statue of Olma in here. Wow, that's like hilarious. They're gonna come right through here, I'm sure of it. And I'm pretty sure they're gonna come right through here. So we'll get whoever's closest to go handle putting these in right now. Awesome. You'd be 10 if you'd be so kind now. You lost your gun back there, though, and we don't have another one for you, so... Let's find one. An Inferno Cannon. No, that's silly. Well, it's actually the only thing we have, unless we want to use the, the triple rocket launcher, and I don't. So, we're actually gonna have BB-10 equip an Inferno Cannon. <laughs> Good to go. That is... <laughs> Look at that! <sighs> okay, first Tusken Raid is incoming. Olma, get over here. Let's make sure all of the animals now are in area one. We'll move it back a smidgy. This is it, boys. This is the final, the final assault from the Tusken Raiders. I did say I was sure they would come through here. Whoa! Grekashyok has gone to run wild. He's fed up with this colony of Jawas and he's like, they can't stop me now. Technically we can't. Things are out of control. Oh, oh, hey Kelly the Tusken Raider. Oh, poor Kelly. Those burn traps do literally nothing. Look at that. One burn for five damage. Meanwhile, Alexi. <laughs> we just took down his literally... Oh, I guess it was just an ebony wall. I thought that was some kind of concrete or something because it was black like a rock. But no. Looks like Arius down here is going to charge after Gomez. You know what? I don't think we need Renton there. Let's have Renton come back. Guard the wall over in this direction. Uh, so hey buddy, so wow, what just happened there? Oma hit Arius mid red blaster bolt. Renton driving her vibro swords point amateurishly, amateur, amateurishly, savagely stabbed Arius in the neck. Wow, that's amateur, huh? Slice off a neck on your very first swing. Okay, well here comes the rest of them. Oh, what a what a mess. What a mess. Ness just died, though, so that's something. It looks like Arson, he got on fire. Renton, if you'd get out here, that would be awesome. Whew, they getting... <laughs> They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. They're running in every direction. Tusken Raiders are fleeing. No surprises there. Holy mother of ridiculous Batman. Oh, Grishashkyolk actually collapsed from the pain. Not running wild anymore, are ya? Food poisoning, infection, burn, gunshot, Tuscan cycler, left kidney destroyed, death in 20 hours. Now then, is that it? Oh! 
shot Renton in the back and destroyed our liver trying to kill something that was completely unnecessary. Oh my god, was that dumb. Wow, and now we're firing inferno cannons with BB-10, lighting our whole base on fire. This is under control, boys. Under control. We have to secure this base. Unfortunately, Renton was our ticket to victory here. All right, Bumba will have to be our ticket to victory. Let's make sure all of this fire is put out so we don't lose the egg and everything else that's over here. Okay, now Bumba's got to come inside. We have to secure this base immediately. Well, turns out Bumba was not the ticket to victory. Bumba has collapsed. He can't quite make it. Everyone else is just not having a good day right now. Nice. The Krayt Dragons are going to eat all the Tuscan Raiders from... Oh! Uh, Grikhashkiosk has apparently been consumed by a crate dragon as a wild animal. Oopsie <laughs> doopsie. Oh my god. <laughs> well, he was just a Wookiee slave, I guess. That's what you get for having crate dragons. After Bumba was done with his nap, our moods were so high, I figured it was about time to finish taking out the raiders. What could possibly go wrong with moods that high? Bumba should be able to take out Cross now. Whoo! One shot on the Cross. Okay, from here, I believe we can come over to this direction, not get shot even once. Fleeby should be coming around the corner when she comes. Alma's now managed to make it through this area. Awesome. Come on, Bumba, any second now. There it is. Ah, oh, so close. Fleeby, come on, man. Almost made it through this direction. Awesome. Now, how the heck are we going to take down Mommy over here? Home is pretty hungry, and look what we found, boys. Food. Yes! Bumba got one. Only one remains. Just have to find the best sneaksy way to get in there, and this is it right here. Awesome. We can claim this base, I think, once we get through this area. <gasps> never mind, never mind. He came in. Hey, buddy. Base destroyed! Factions with Northwest, Koistia, 20. Sabaron, 20. We have become very close. They now consider us an ally. Well, what do you know? Eridol, Pantoran, Jawa Clan, Jawa Clan, Galactic Republic, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. Oh, look at this. The Separatist Droid Army now considers us friends. Little did they know we're not friends at all. We're ready to get in there and murder them. Something fierce. Well, if we now own this base, that means we can claim every one of these doors. And check this out. Oma, go over there. Bumba, come over here. Ah, uh -huh. would you look at that? All manner of operating rooms. Okay. Table with some food. Same deal. Oh, resurrect a back Sarah, that's six Luciferium. This is what we're talking about right now. Renton, guess what, buddy? Oma, if you would be so kind 
use a Resurrector Mech Serum. We're gonna use it over here on Renton. Boom! And Resurrector Mech Serum. And we'll use it right up over here on Kyodio Suzuki. Pretty sure that's an accurate representation. Uh, uh, now, I did expect to have my third Wookiee alive, um, but alas, <laughs> White Dragon saw to it. Uh, yeah, that was not great for us. I guess we don't have to deal with the infection at any rate. It's all good, boys. Kyodolosugi is alive! Oh no! He's got dementia and he's blind blind! Uh-oh. <laughs> Dude, that was not even fair. He's been there for like 10 seconds. What the heck? Oh my god, I don't want a blind overweight Wookiee on my team. Renton has been brought back to life. Huzzah! Renton, how goes your issue? Brain dementia. I can't believe this. I thought these things were pretty much guaranteed to be fine if you used it right away. Well, um, hmm. I guess we could go hi hyper luciferium, right? Bumba also just got hit there a little bit, but he'll be fine on the way down. Look at this mess. Absolute mess of a base. Literally an hour ago, we were just having a grand old time on Endor. It was Jawa Happy Festival time. Or, as is known in the Jawa lands, who's gonna get <laughs> Anyways, right now we're looking at no food, no beds, every single person wounded. Uh, the droid probably can't get energy or batteries. Gomez is on a mental break. Ulma and Bumba are right behind him. We've lost one of our three slaves, and the other two have been turned into freaking zombies, apparently. All I need to do now is disable the turrets, loot the base, and exact revenge on the Separatist droid army. Easy.